Hi, everybody. Mark Rushton of MarkRushtonGallery.com. It's a Sunday afternoon, late afternoon, April 2, 2023. And I figured I'd, I started doing this work and I thought, <clears throat> why not do a live stream? I know it's not the most exciting thing in the world. What I'm doing is I'm making, I'm preparing small paintings for show kits. What's a show kit? Well, it's where you take a, a painting. And well, I'll just show you here. I'll show you what, what it, my interpretation of what a show kit is. So I've got, I got these paintings here that are, in this case, this one is, um, make sure this is angled correctly here. So this is um, acrylic ink on spun bonded olefin. I'm going to cut another little piece of tape here. Spun bonded olefin is also known as Tyvek. And I'm adhering the Tyvek to a cardstock here with what they call Tyvek tape. I've been using Tyvek for eh, more than 30 years on and off. I really love it. It's a really great surface. And so what I want to be able to do here is uh, I don't want to frame everything that I have. So I'm creating what's called a show kit. And so I've gone ahead and I've created like a generic card here with my name and that's a QR code to my mailing list. And then I just wrote in the title here, break glow. And I thought, well, that's, that's good. Then I'm not, I don't like to be at the computer that much. And besides, uh, I kind of like writing these out, you know, I kind of like writing them out. It's a, a personal, you know, a little bit more personal printing off a computer it, it's a little you know it's a lot yeah I, don't, I like writing this stuff out so i think i want to put the the fold on the back side here and then what i want to do is oh there we go i already got break glow there on that one and i'm just going to stick this little card back in here and then that way i know what it is And there you go. That's a show kit. That's a show kit. So then you go and you put that in a uh, a print folder thing where you can kind of kind of flip through them. You can look at the different paintings. Um, they're just a little bit. They're not as prepared as a framed painting, but you know, if somebody wants one that's not framed, that's good. Which makes me think, oh, I better have some extra. Do I need extra frames? No, I'll just pop one out of another frame. Let's put one of these in a show kit. It's, it's not a big deal. So I got a bunch more to do. And I thought, well, you know what? I'll just hang out, kind of talk through the process here. Might be boring for some. I don't, I don't know. I don't know how many more I got to do, like 10 or so. So what I have to do is I have to go through this... Um, This portfolio here and just kind of get an idea of what maybe I want to include. Just kind of this camera is not exactly filming everything now, is it? Well, like yeah, just the way that it is here. Now, this is a nice one. Dusk in the Hills. Let's pull this one out here. Take a look at it. Well, that's very nice. Yeah, let's see. Let's do this one here. But I have to prepare it a little bit. It's unprepared. So Dusk in the Hills. And we'll get rid of the number there because we don't use that number numbering system anymore. Eight by ten, which is the orientation. Eight tall, ten wide. I'll get this.
painter's tape off here, which I like using, but I don't want to use that for a uh, finished piece. Let's get this uh, Tyvek tape out here. We'll do it in two sections. That's not a big deal. This won't take that long with you around. I have somebody to talk to while I'm doing this. There we go. Take this last bit off and seal up the corner here. I did things a little bit different when I was making these. These are from eh, a few years ago. But I love them. And they're still representative of what I do, which is that abstract landscape. Using acrylic ink. I think this is acrylic ink. Is this acrylic ink? It's not acrylic paint. I think that's acrylic ink. Was I using ink by then? I think I was. Dusk in the hills. So, write that here on the card. See how easy that is? That's mounted. Ready for framing. That's nice. And that's garbage. Pull another uh, plastic bag out. Is this like a seal? I guess it is like a seal. Well, I'll worry about that later there. That looks nice. Even in plastic. Looks very nice. Put that there. On to the next one. Take a look at some of these here. You can look at them sideways. I guess I'm looking at them sideways too. Oh, I like this one here. Let's take a look at it here. See how differently I, I used to do things? This is on cardstock. It is using Tyvek tape. But then I wrote on the painting. I don't do that anymore. Let's see if this can be, uh, let's see what this looks like here. Let's see if this will hide that. It does a nice job. I don't know about that though. I don't, I don't know about this piece. that back in there. Not sure about it. Maybe I should uh, show some of these off here. Huh? Ooh. What is this? Application. The dark painting, you know what they say? Nobody likes dark paintings. Yeah, they do. Yes, they do. Hmm. Let's 
put this away here just a little bit. I like that, but get in there. I wish there was a better way to store these. Late harvest. Look at this. This is uh, acrylic paint on watercolor paper. I want to include this. I mean, that's nice. Let's include it. This one's going just because it's a little bit different. Lave Harvest, Mark Rushton, 8 by 10. This is a lot less work, too. But I like the painting, Late Harvest. Looks nice. There you go. Late harvest. Said it doesn't take long. I'm not one of these people that goes and frets about things forever. They either strike me or they don't. For whatever reason. I mean, I make things and I catalog them and you know, but that amazing, crazy landscape. When did I make that? I like that, it's different. You know, it's gonna let's put the the mat out of here oh yeah that's beauty look at you get kind of a pink horizon here right on the edge a little yellowish conveying a i'm up for it amazing crazy landscape let's call it that There you go. Having a hard time with this one here. There we go. Looks good. Take a look at that. That's nice. Ah, I love this little goofy little landscapes that I've got. And then I get into the book paintings here. And I have non-book paintings in here. I do. Oh. Oh, that one's so good. 
how many non-book paintings? I got several in there. They're, they're that's a good cross reference. I know I've got more in here, but I do have a lot of book paintings. Oh, that one's so good. The similarities with that Rothko. Oh, yeah. This is really okay. Pull this one out. Book paintings. Paintings on damaged or soon to be destroyed books. I'm not destroying them. Somebody else was going to be destroying them. Just throw them away. I save them and I turn them into artworks. Recycled art. What's this one called again? Minimize. Kind of scratch that one there. Scratched it all out. That looks nice. I really like that one. It's like you're looking across like a lake or something like that. Or a field. Or a lake. And then there's all those mathematical symbols. I think that's kind of great. Next. Next we got here what is that one of dissimilarities well that's crazy those are good Which one? Which one? This one for sure. But I also like this one here. Let's pull this one out. How's this look? That looks good. Me and my scrawl.
Notation described. I like that. I don't think I'll include this one. That one. <laughs> Not sure about that one. Ooh, that's good. Ultramedic tree of organizational structure. Let's see what this looks like. How many have I got left? Four or five? I got like five left. This is going a lot faster than I thought. Well, of course. Easy to put together. Easy. Let's look at this one here a little bit. Ultrametric tree of organizational structure. It's nice. That's a good one. Yeah, I really love this dissimilarities. Can't believe I didn't pick that one for um, framing, but. Oh, if I could, I'd frame them all. Maybe I will someday. They just, they just, they're, they're arrive framed and that's that. But, you know, if you make them not framed, you can offer them at a much more reasonable price. Oh. And then, you know, if somebody wants to put this in uh, a different color frame or they want a different mat, uh, they can do that. If you're like, oh, I want this one in a yellow mat. That's fine. T I S S I M I L A R I T I E S. Dissimilarities. I don't know if you can play that in Scrabble. Yeah, I'm focusing on new work, but I do have old work. You never you never let go of your catalog. Never give up on your catalog. I may have paintings from a few years ago that I still love. Doesn't mean just because they were made a few years ago that they're not valid, you know. Arson, burglary, perjury, shoplifting, vandalism. Vandalism. That's a nice one, too. And that one's good also. What else we got? Oh. I like this one. Path length distances. Do I have enough cards here? I'm down to one card. Let me go print off some more, I guess. You don't have to do that.
many more do I have? Three? I have three. I'm out of cards. So give me a second here, and uh, let me, I'll just put this right here. I'll be, I, let me go print the cards off, and I'll be right back. I feel like it's six. Doesn't take long to print things. This went along real fast. Oops. Oopsie. There we go. Put these aside. Good. That's a nice one. Pink sunset. Pink sunset for everyone. How's that look? That looks nice. What is going on here? All sorts of trouble. Pink sunset. What have I got left? Two? I got two. Two. It's going to be book paintings. Oh, no, 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 no. One of them's not going to be a book painting because greenish haze, I think. Yep. Oops, whoops, whoops, whoops. Greenish haze. That 
That's nice. What's the last one going to be? I mean, I'm going to bring my book down. Oh, oh, ooh. What do we got here in the back? That's a, I think I like this one here. Yeah, I like that one too. I got a lot of purple already. Let's go back to the front of the book here real quick. Let's see what else we got. Uh, the old stuff. I think. I mean, I love some of these, but they were the early works. Good, but you know what? I'm going to go with. It's really down to these two here. Down to these two. Which ones? This one. Blue Hills in the Distance. See how that one is uh, all kind of sideways there on that page? It's mounted that way. That's Wow, well, that's how I wanted it to present. Right? So when you put the... When you put the uh, pre-cut mat on, yeah, I wanted it to present like this. So in order to get it to present like that, I had to have it... See how sideways that is? And like down the page and then you apply the masking and it just the how you it's more than just the painting it's uh also how you present it and then here i am showing how showing how the sausage is made i know a lot of artists don't like that but it motivates me. What can I say? Blue hills in the distance. It motivates me. I'm getting it done, right? There's worse things I could be doing right now. You know, Time is at 5.42 p.m. Central Time. Take a look at that. Ah, uh, that's nice. That looks really good. My portfolio, which I'm going to have to clean up a little bit. I've got some extra plastic bags here. I am out of pre cut mats, although. Tomorrow I might swing over to one of the other Hobby Lobbies that I haven't bought out. The pre -co wait, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait a second. What are, what are these? What are these sitting over here? Oh, hey, you know what? Let's extend this a little bit more. Let's do two more. That's nice. Let's do, let's do two more. Do I need to... I wonder if I got any more. Uh, I, well, I got a. Is this one? This I got three. I got three. We got three more. Stick around. I don't know if I got anything beyond that there. I just go in there. I got more plastic bags, and I've got nine by twelves. Let's uh. Prep some more cards. I have two more cards here. There we go. All right. What do we got? We got these. Let's go back through the book again.
Marsh Glow. That's a good one. Let's take a look at this. Yeah, we'll do Marsh Glow. Do a little extra work to it, though. Um... Eight by ten. Where did the uh, oh, there it is. There's the tie back tape. Get this adhered down here. back on there. Marsh Glow. Prepare the card. Oops. Oopsie. Let's bring them all out here. out. Yeah, what do you think? Five sixty one. How long ago was that? Is that like four, four or five years ago? Marsh glow. All right, two more, two more. What do we got in the, I love Thicket, but I already have that as a um, acrylic. Aries too much like Marsh Glow. I wanna have a nice wide range of things. No one likes dark paintings. You know. Hey, there's a niche for everything. Did you know that? Did you know that there's a niche for everything? Let's see what this looks like here. I'm tempted. Just because I kind of feel like, you know, I should bring down a range of work. Everything shouldn't be samey. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do this one. Oh, look, it's ready to go. Um, all I got to do is add this. 8 by 10. And then I got to make the card. I'm so... Uh, so inventive with those titles. Night Landscape. It looks good. Yeah. Who doesn't love the dark side, right? Look at that. Nightscape. Night landscape. Night landscape should be nightscape, but. That's fine. All right, one more. One more. I swear, one more. What 
What do we got here? Anything else? Application. I do kind of like that one. Uh, a little too brown. It's a little too Ukraine. Mm -mm -mm. I'll look up one up here. No, I can do that. We're going to get into the uh, oh, tall grass in summer. No. compute look at that one that one's about ready to fall apart but i kind of love it i think this was the first book painting that i did that i completed anyway look at that man i ripped that out of the book see how that is that's a mess but No wonder. I was kind of a mess then. I'm always a mess. Put this on here. How are we looking? That looks nice. It cleans up well. We compute. All right, let me take a look around the studio here and see if I have accidentally orphaned anything else. I don't think I have. Anything else that I have is, you know, that that's larger. That's 9 by 12. Um, I have five by sevens. I've got, oh, I've got these. I gotta get back to drawing, you know. Some paper here. I think we're good. How long is this video? Forty-five minutes. Oh my god. Yeah, I think I've used all the. Uh, I think I've used all the pre-cut mats. How many more plastic bags do I have here? I got one, two, three, four, five. And then I got some more down here. No. Yes. One, two, three, four. Five. Oh, I've got probably. 15 more. It's good to have extras. Well, anyway, um, gosh. That only took 45 minutes to get done. Well, you know, when you get a camera on you and you people watching it, you got to do something. <laughs> so anyway, uh, I'll probably be back later with a painting video. Even though I've done a lot today. But there's always more to do. Um, that's it. Mark Rushton, markrushtongallery.com. Talk to you later. Thanks for hanging out.